wanted to bring you another one of the five minute videos and today I wanted to cover the topic of dead on arrival. Now, the last video that I did was about receiving your fish in the mail and basically the acclimation process to take when you receive your fish. Now, what happens if that fish arrives to you dead? The first thing first is do not, under any circumstances, do not open that bag. Do not open that bag. Make sure that you get very clear pictures of the deceased fish in the unopened bag. That is the most important part of the whole DOA policy. So what you want to do is once you have the pictures of the deceased fish in the bag, you then need to contact your Now there's often a lot of things that go into play with DOA policies and the majority of the ones that either I've written or I have read typically state that within one hour of receiving your fish, so one hour of the delivery date and time, you need to contact the seller with the picture of the deceased fish in the bag. Now, after you've contacted the seller and you've sent the pictures, typically you will either be offered a refund for the fish or a replacement fish. It's important to note that you will be responsible for shipping, period. You will not get the shipping costs refunded unless by some very, very fluke situation that it is a seller's issue. If your fish is received, say for instance, I ship one to three days, if your fish is received on the third or the fourth day, there should be absolutely no reason that, that fish is dead unless it, there has been extremely rough handling of the fish during shipping or there's extreme weather conditions. That's the only real reason why something should arrive to you dead. Um, bad shipping procedures, the box wasn't insulated correctly, the, um, the shipping was delayed for God knows whatever reason. There's a lot that goes into play, but as from a seller's standpoint, when I ship my fish, my boxes are fully insulated, heat bags or cool packs are provided should they be needed, and my fish are packaged very, very well. And to this day, I haven't had a fish arrive DOA. Once that fish's bag is, is opened, typically your DOA policy will be null and void and you will not be able to get a refund. So it's very, very important that you make sure that the, the steps are taken. You discover that your fish is dead. You have taken clear and concise pictures of that fish in the bag. Send them to your seller within one hour and be polite. That is the next biggest thing. Being polite with your words makes people a lot less argumentative or pointing the finger of blame at somebody else. It's very important that you have clear, polite communication with your seller and vice versa. It's just going to be a better experience for you both. Definitely make sure that those things are taken care of and you should have no problem with receiving a full refund of the fish or being offered a replacement. It's very unlikely that a fully healthy fish received in three days would be dead on arrival. So those are my little tips for this one. I hope you enjoyed it. It went a little over five minutes. I apologize. But join me for the next one. And don't forget to click the subscribe button so you can uh, make sure that you don't miss the next one. Have a great day, guys. As always, take care. I don't really know what the word is. Hi guys, 
It's Shishi from Shishi's Aquatics, and today I'm coming. Hi guys, it's Shishi, and this is another video on. I actually don't know. I completely forgot what my video is about. Hi guys, Shishi from Shishi's Aquatics. I hope you are all well. Welcome to my channel. If you haven't already, subscribe. And today I wanted to talk about something that I forgot again, the second time. Yay. 